Welcome back guys to a brand new video and today we're gonna to be talking about another youtuber Yume iOS This dude makes some of the best content I've ever seen. So basically what this guy does he literally takes critical ops and remodels the whole entire thing in this different software and then makes these crazy edits out of it and they are really good I mean they are some of the most high quality things I've ever seen in the critical ops community it looks amazing. it looks like just Imagine this Critical Ops graphics on steroids. It really does look really good. I mean, this is definitely some of the best content we've ever seen. So then I'm just going to be showcasing the guy. I really think this guy deserves a lot more just attention for the stuff he is bringing to the community. So I'm going to go ahead and play this video to you guys. And this is one he created for Critical Ops. And I have to say, it looks so good. So it's basically him sniping through all the different maps. And he shows off every map, and this is high quality. First starts off with them. I think he starts off with Legacy. I'm not sure. He starts off with Bureau in the Bureau, and it looks really cool. And definitely take this out for yourself because he has he has this amazing music going on with it. I mean, it really looks insane. The quality, it looks past console. It's just like just really good. I mean, insane. And just the way he creates it and recreates all the maps in this high level of detail and the crazy shadows. It's something we would not even be able to see if it wasn't for this guy. And I'm really shocked. I'm just so shocked. He doesn't have more subscribers. He should at least have like 100,000 or at least more than Rooks. I mean, the, the amount of quality and the work that goes into these videos is insane. He really does deserve more. I think he's only at like 5,000 subs right now. So I'm going to link his YouTube channel in the description because some of the content in here, it, it's just insane. It really is. And this really just had me mad imagining what would the next critical ops look like honestly because um i know i know critical ops is not going to make a new game anytime soon at least for the next couple years the last game was critical ops missions which is only about i think two three years ago so yeah they definitely have a huge gap in between each game and i'm pretty sure it's going to be years and years from before seeing this critical ops, but the game is getting kind of stale and i'm really curious because these graphics they're insane. This is some next gen stuff. And I know it's not actual gameplay on a foreign thing, but the way he makes it is really cool. And even has videos of him actually showing how he makes this stuff. And it, it's just insane the amount of detail and the work it takes to sit there and literally 3D model a whole entire area of a map that animated him shooting through it. The fact that somebody would take and do do that amount of work for a mobile game is just insane. So definitely check out his channel, guys. I just wanted to show saw some of his content, the screenshots. He is working on a new project right now. I don't know what it's called, but it's definitely going to be really good. And he actually also made a cool, like, Bullet Force Zombies thing. You guys have to check out some of his stuff. He deserves so, so much more just... Just more attention for the things making it so much more views. I mean, it is some really good stuff. But let me know think about these concepts and the um screenshots I showed you and some of the 3D modeling he's done and the way he made these maps look. Definitely know what you think about this. But um leave a like if you enjoyed the video. Again, don't forget to check out his YouTube channel and his Twitter. And if you really care, don't forget that subscribe button. Peace, guys.